Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. I hope that you guys are enjoying your day. Well, honey, evidently BBL Dreezy can't seem can't seem to get over Rihanna, right? So in his latest round of dis uh di let's diss Rihanna because I'm still broken hearted because ASAP, ASAP Rocky has got my my ex woman, right? So ASAP Rocky, uh, I mean Drake threw shots said ASAP Rocky on his latest diss track. Uh, family members, family matters. Now he in the middle of a beef with Kendrick Lamar. Beef is just is slamming him down all over the place, but he still has time to think about ASAP Rocky um, and Rihanna. In fact, and the fact that they are happy together, right? So he wants to mention them in family matters. Um, he simply can't get over it. But when you snooze, you lose. Drake is the reason why him and Rihanna broke up. If you can remember, they had been on and off since like 2009. Of 2010 up until Drake went and got pregnant um by the ex um you know a porn star um Italian woman which has uh which he now has a son with the son named Adonis right so he messed up that all by himself uh 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 uh, uh, uh child Rihanna went on to do went on to do bigger and better things she started Fenty um you know during covid she said that in an interview she said that her and ASAP Rocky started out as friends um and do, but during that time they became a couple they got closer and closer together you know and a little while after that we saw Rihanna's baby bump because her and ASAP Rocky were um you know welcoming in their first son Rizza and now they also have a second son together, but Drake is still salty about it. But like I said, it is Drake's fault um, that he is um, not with Rihanna anymore because he shouldn't have fooled around on her. And also, not only that, that people were saying that allegedly ASAP Rocky, uh, I mean, um, that uh, uh, allegedly that Drake wasn't so nice to Rihanna, you know, and he's still from time to time, even up to a few months ago, um, you know, he had his, he had his, um, you know, whoever plays the music for his concerts start out with the work song. And he was like, stop, we're not doing that tonight and blah, 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 and blah, blah, blah. So he's still in his feelings. But but ASAP Rocky is not backing down. You know, he dissed Drake um, on the album with, with uh, I believe it was a Future and Metro Boomin and uh, a lot of the other ones. This was his verse, and it was geared towards Drake. Drake is still salty, right? So anyway whatever he's just gonna still have to still be heartbroken because rihanna the moved right along also in an interview um a short time ago rihanna said that this is the happiest that she has ever been in her life um she is in a really good place raising her children right now she's focused on her children as well as her relationship with asap rocky uh they seem to be really good together and even though asap rocky is going through um some legal battles right now um him and rihanna and the children are still doing very very well right now we can't say that for <laughs> for bbl drizzy so when it comes to bbl drizzy how he got that name is from this producer um by the name of metro booming metro booming did a diss um track against drake it's which which switch and i think that it turned uh drake cheeks red and he just went for Kendrick Lamar after this BBL uh, Drizzy thing right so BBL Drizzy also um turned um his beat um into a contest right so the BBL Drizzy contest has gone like global right and so Metro Boomin has turned the contest he said an update to the contest the winner of the contest um gets ten thousand dollars and a beat um, runner up gets a beat as well. Uh, you should hashtag BBL Drizzy, you know, for the giveaway, right? And like I said, it's gone viral. It's gone global, right? Um, it's all over um, Twitter, uh, which is now called X. It's gone viral on TikTok. Everybody um, is doing these these of uh, these covers, their own rendition of the BBL Drizzy beat, right? One person said, "So far, I've heard BBL Drizzy uh, in merengue." Charlie did a merengue edition. Um, they did an Afro beats edition. They did a Memphis edition, a New York edition, a Jersey Club beats edition, and also even Japan has a BBL Drizzy edition. She goes on to say that I have never in all my days 
plays heard of being dissed by a producer with a beat, L-M-F-A-O. Like he dissed him with a beat and it's gone viral since then. You have a pop version, <laughs> a pop version of the BBL Dizzy or diss. Somebody put the, the track over the top of of uh, of a Megan the Stallion, you know her Monday, one of her Monday, um, her Monday freestyles. They mixed it with the BBL Drizzy B. Child, it's just going everywhere. They doing everything from it. Like I said, everything from a merengue to pop to to a Japan beat, right? So I'm thinking a uh, uh, Drizzy Drake ain't real happy right now, right? Oh, and, and in the meantime, in between time, you guys make sure you check out um the Hulu documentary concerning black Twitter. Now I've checked this out. It's a really good documentary. Um, who knew that, um, you know, black Twitter, you know, had made such an impact on social media. Right. So now guys check that out, make sure, you know, and like I said, Drizzy, uh, Drake is not in a happy place by now, not to mention the fact that since, um, uh, he lost his, he lost his battle with cancer. Kendrick Lamar, the battle that he started, you know, uh, uh, I mean, his sales are going down. They're not selling his clothes. His Nike shoes are not selling. They say that his his sales have gone down um, in his stores like London and other places. Nobody ain't fooling with Drake right now um, except to diss him. He is being dissed internationally, right? So uh, now when it comes to the story of Edadon, I wonder if you guys remember that. It was by Pusha T. This is actually Drake in blackface. He actually did this as a teenager when he was on TV in Canada, which is why Kendrick Lamar was right when he when he when he rapped. We don't want to hear you say and work no more, right? It will make sense. That now makes sense, right? But anyway, that's all I got. You guys, please like, share, and subscribe to the channel. And if you decide to subscribe to this channel, please hit the please hit that notifications bell so that you will be notified when I drop another video. Okay, let me know what you guys think about this, all of this that's going on with Drake. Um you know, in the comment section, do you think that he can, you know, bounce back from this? You know what I mean? Some people were, um, you know, <laughs> saying that in order for him to bounce back, he's there's going to have to be a sacrifice made, right? But anyway, that's another video. Um, but for right now, I'm, I'm going to talk to you guys later. Bye-bye. Peace.